Hello everyone, I would like to start today's video by thanking you guys. Thank you so much for showing so much love on our video. But I have a small row to pick with you. You guys like our content, but I believe you guys are forgetting to hit the like button. If you hit the like button, it will actually keep us motivated. And I can assure you that we are going to create such videos every Friday. Let's go ahead with today's question. This is the question in front of you. Just pause the video. Give it a try, and then resume to see the solution. So let's start with interpreting the question. Question says, number of five digit numbers which are divisible by five and each number containing the digit five, digits being all different is equal to k times four factorial. What is the value of k? Okay, so we need to find five digit numbers, those five digit numbers which are divisible by five and should contain five. Now a 5 digit number which is divisible by 5 will either have a 0 or a 5 at its unit place, right? So it has some cases and let's discuss each case individually. Case number 1, when we have a 5 digit number which ends with a 5. Now a 5 digit number that ends with a 5 is, all, is completely divisible by 5 and also has a 5 digit 5 in it second case in which this five digit number is going to end with zero and has a five at its tens place. The third case which the five digit number is going to end with a zero but has a five at its hundreds place. Fourth case is going to be a five digit number that ends with a zero but has a five at its thousand place. And the fifth and the last case is going to be a five digit number that ends with zero and has a five at its ten thousandth place. How many numbers can I make in case one? I have used a five over here. I cannot use a zero at this place because using zero will make it a four digit number. So I'm just left with eight more different digits which I can put. Then now at this point I've already used 5 and a digit over here. So out of 10 I've already used 2 digits and since repetition is not allowed so I can use 8. I'm left with 8 more options. Then again since I've already used three, box, uh, 3 numbers to fill these 3 boxes I'm left with 7 options and then 6 options for this particular box. Now let's discuss case number 2. In this, I have three boxes and the two boxes are already fit, filled with 0 and 5. I can fill this box in eight different ways, this box in seven different ways and this box in six different ways. So a total of eight times seven times six. The number of ways uh, in which the case number two is can be dealt. Now if I see cases these four cases two three four and five all four of them are identical each one of them has a zero and a five and the and the positions are fixed that means i need to fill the remaining three boxes and i have eight seven and six options to fill them with so again in this case i can get eight times seven times six numbers and case number four can be de uh, dealt in eight times seven times Six ways and again case number five which is again going to be eight times seven times six. So these are the number of ways in which a five digit number can be made which is divisible by five and also has a five as its digit. If I add all of them I can see that eight times seven times six is common. I have eight over here. And four ones. One, two, three, and four. This uh, total is going to be equal to k times four factorial. So four factorial is four times three times two times one. That is twenty-four. So twenty-four k is going to be eight times seven times six times twelve. That means k is. One sixty eight. 
that means my second option is absolutely correct i hope you understood this solution if that's true don't forget to hit the like button share it with your friends and subscribe our channel for more such insights